All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my weekly Minecraft chill stream. Now, last time around when I played Minecraft and chill, um, it ended up being a little bit on the weird side. And the reason I say that is it was actually during my E3 coverage, so it ended up being an early stream, which obviously is weird. Usually, I don't do this as an early stream. I do it as a late night stream, as I'm doing tonight. Um, and when I did that, uh, it threw off the timing, and I couldn't, I couldn't play as long as I usually do. Usually, I play two hours or more, and I only got to play like 90 minutes. This week, it's going to be a full two-hour stream. And what we're going to be doing is following up on the stuff that I did last week. I want to see how, you know, my paths are turning out and everything here. And then I want to basically build a similar gate to this one over on the other side where there's another fence. Um, I forget where the actual fence is that I put it, but I want to put another gate and another path on the other side. And then I want to see, do I need some lighting? Maybe I can build, like, a fire pit or something here for some light. Um... And at some point, I think by the end of today's stream, what I want to do is interact with the villagers and see what it is they need to trade so I can head back to my settlement and plant carrots that I'm going to take from here. But also what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, be tr getting the items I need to trade as well as grabbing some name tags because, ladies and gentlemen, this is something I'm doing special starting tonight for the suggestion of people two sessions ago. Uh, starting tonight when I play Minecraft, the top contributor of the night will get something in the town named after them. It could be anything. It could be a villager. It could be this chicken. Okay? It could be this house right here. You know, it could be one of these houses. It could be, you uh, you know, something, something hall. We could name the bell, the town bell after you. But something in the town will be named after the top contributor of the night. All right? Don't know how we're going to, you know, what people are going to choose or whatever. This will be interesting to see who is the top contributor by the end of the night. Okay? Now... I want to say shout out to Tadpoles Playing Tennis, who just tipped me $2. That's the, that's the first tip of the night. Let's get him up on the leaderboard here before we start. What the hell? Tadpoles. Playing tennis. Okay. Thank you very much. And we just got a 100 bitch here from the Realm of Chaos. And he said, hey, Phil, first time watching a stream. Looking forward to Crash Team Racing later in the week. Do you have a favorite character from the Crash Bandicoot franchise? I mean, honestly, Crash, you know. I mean, there were a lot of characters. I've, I only played the first three games. I should make that abundantly clear. I only played Crash 1 through 3. Uh, I played 1, the original 1 on PS1, many years back. And then when the Crash Remaster Trilogy came out, I played 2 and 3 on that. And then eventually I replayed 1 again. Um, so I never really played anything past that and i'm sure there were many more characters after that but that's all i'm i'm in the know about okay nihilus the goldfish says is it just top cheer or tips or both or one each it's going to be top contrib contribution overall tonight okay that's what it's going to be whoever is the top contributor overall not cumulative but in one go all right that's how we're going to figure it out Someone actually just asked, well, what about people watching on YouTube? Can I, we also retroactively contribute? Um, you know, I didn't even think about that. I'll be very honest with you, I didn't. I didn't think that far. Let's put it this way. Tonight is just going to be based on stream. However, if people like this event, and they're like, man, I want to do that, but I'm a YouTube viewer, then, and if, let's say a bunch of people contact me, and they're like, yeah, Phil, we would like to do that, then I would have to figure that out, but I would, I would definitely consider it. What it would have to be, I guess, is an offline contribution, not one during a live stream, but if someone were to contribute offline and say, this is for Minecraft, then I would consider it, okay? Okay, Yoshino Lover did a 405-bit cheer. So that actually puts Yoshino Lover in the top spot for tonight so far. Thank you, Yoshino Lover. Let's get you up on the leaderboard there. Very nice, thank you. Why is your, your O capitalized, I... Stupid keyboard. Yoshino. There we go. Okay. Very good. Let's take a look. Let's see how my path has grown, and let's see how it's turning out, and let's try not to let this cat out. All right, there it goes. How are my trees grown? Are they all grown? No. It looks like... What the hell? Everything on one side grew. Well, not everything. There's one sapling. Everything on one side kind of grew, and on the other side, like, nothing grew. I wonder what happened there. Okay. Huh. So I guess what we're going to have to do is... I could either just wait. You know, I'm just going to wait because I was going to say we could get some bone meal. Let's not do that yet. Let's just go over here and... Uh, let's go over here. 
And I, let's go find the other gate. Build the other gate. How much wood do I have? I got a good amount, but I don't know if I have enough. I only have 74 blocks. Oh, I'm going to run out, aren't I? Oh, son of a bitch. I'm going to have to cut down more trees. Seriously? I've cut down so many trees. I've deforested the whole area. <laughs> it's getting tiring cutting down the trees. I'm tired of it. Oh, my God. Where are my uh, storage boxes? i got to find them. <clears throat> Let's find out. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Bubble Bullet Bill, don't worry. I can tell you during the course of the stream who the top contributor is. That's all you have to worry about. When, when contributions come in, I will tell you who the top contributor is. It's that simple. Okay? There you go. Um, I wanted to see if I had any... I don't have any more wood stored right now. Let me put some stuff away. Put the bone away. I don't need the apples. Put the apples away. Don't. Well, I might need the seeds eventually. I got a corn flower. I don't even know where I got that from. I just randomly picked it up. Oh, I do have... Okay, I do have the carrots stored for that I'm going to take back to my town. Um, shit. I might need more wood. Where is my other gate? I have to find the other gate. Is this it here? Here's the other gate. Now, this gate, I have going down to the water. This is different. See that? This is very different from how I was doing it previously because I had it as a path with trees. What I'd like to do here is maybe build a dock... With some fencing, right? So I have a river that I can actually sail in and out of right here. I think that would be pretty cool. And that's kind of what I want to do. But I think what I'm going to have to do is make this kind of even, this this ground here. Uh, let's see here. I think I'm probably going to make it oak wood planks. This whole area. Yeah, let's see here. Oh, let's see here. Real Zeria just reached over 27 months. I hope you were doing good. Sorry I haven't been able to watch lately, but I continue my rub for you. I don't know what that means, your rub. <laughs> I Hopefully that doesn't mean something bad, but thank you very much. Oh, let's see here. Uh, Jake, no, it's not like that. Jake's like, but what about when, when fees are taken for PayPal and this and that? That's not how we're doing it. Like I said, don't worry about it. I will tell you guys who is the current top contributor of the night so you will know exactly what's going on and there will be no confusion. Right now, it is currently Yoshino Lover who's the top contributor of the night. All right? Samson tipped me a dollar and said, I, I was wondering if you ever played Luigi's Mansion on YouTube. All I found was one video of a 3DS test stream. I never played it. I never played the original and I own, the, you're right, Dark Moon, which is the sequel. Uh, I own that on the 3DS and I never actually did a playthrough of it at all. So the answer is no, I never played it, so you're not... So you can't find it, so it doesn't exist. Okay? Okay? And the Steve did a 100-bit cheer. He says, when you get back... Uh-oh. When you get back home to film base, make a grindstone. Use it to convert all of your enchanted loot from fishing into XP for a lot of extra levels. Oh, really? A grindstone will convert the extra enchanted loot to XP? I did not know that. How does this look? Looks uniform and consistent. I think what I want to do is get rid of these blocks on the side. I'm going to put fencing, I think, next to it. That's nice. It gets rid of those extra blocks. I also want to build a big gate here like I did on the other side. Oh, shit. Is it nighttime? It is. I got to go to sleep. Yeah, what I want to do, I want to build fencing here like I did on the other side. There we go. Not fencing. I want to build a gate here. Like, build here a, a big gate. I guess what it'll have to do, it'll probably combine with this tower and go over here and, be, and like, probably touch the side of this, too. Um, to have a big arching gateway as an entrance to the city from this end. Okay? Alright, well, I'm going to work on that more, but i got to go to sleep. Mr. Popovich here. Actually, let me get these $2 up on the leaderboard here. So we're up to $4 in tips tonight. 
Mr. Bubble, very true. He said, would be fine on a straight path and row of trees, or would you want to start something custom, making something more organic, have more lush-looking ground? I can also show you how to make custom trees. If you have a favorite kind of tree, like a willow or a cherry tree, I can show you how to do that or something more fancy. Dude, I would like, I would definitely like cool trees, but I don't think I have anything to do them yet. Um, I don't think I have anything to do with them yet. So if, if there's a way to do them easily or find it, but if it's something that's complicated, I probably can't do it. I don't think I found any of those special trees you're mentioning. Um, Awful Waffle, hit me a dollar, says, Thanks, your one Yakuza 4 playthrough helped me find a locker key that was a pain in the butt to find. Thanks, my dude. You're welcome, Awful Waffle. And I just received a $20 tip from a name that I cannot pronounce. Good Lord. Look at this. Um, Pard Word Gebajibadib Varkin. <laughs> Holy macaroni. I can't pronounce that name, and more than likely, that's probably something bad. I'm curious. I'm, i got to find out what this means. Before we continue on, I want to know what this phrase means. Let's find out, everyone. I'm sure we're going to get a laugh out of this one. Ready? We're going to get a laugh out of this one. Let's see. Word. Word. Here we go. Oh, my God. This is definitely... um. This is... Uh, what is it? Swedish? It sounds like it sounds like the name of something at IKEA. Oh yeah, I can tell you right now the hard means horse. So it's probably some kind of an insult about my wife or something stupid. I'm sure. I can't tell because everything here is in another language. <laughs> so I don't know what it means. But pard means horse. So that's fine. Just as a word, it's not insulting. So thank you for the tip. And I'm going to put you up on the leaderboard as pard, as the top tipper. Okay? There you go. Thank you for the $20 tip. Generous. Probably insulting, but generous. <laughs> okay, then. We've got some more shout-outs to do before we even continue here. We've got Golden Nobles cheered. 95 bits and watching you play Minecraft is making me miss my world half a year gone. Aw. Uh, half a year away. Half a year from playing it, huh? You know, it's, always, it's never too late to start up again, I guess. Um, Glory Hole Theme Park cheered. Said my wife left me. Sorry to hear that. Sorry about that. Um, Vote Communist at 100 bit cheer. Again, asking for comparisons. Guys, I will tell you who the top contributor is. All you need to know is I will tell you who the top contributor is. You don't have to worry about valuation of anything. I will tell you, okay? Mega Man, uh, NT125 did 100 bit cheers. If playthroughs of Luigi's Mansion remake on 3DS and Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon would be a great spooky event. Maybe for October to lead to Lu Luigi's Mansion 3. The first game could be beaten in two streams. It's really that short, huh? That sounds like a short Nintendo game. Interesting. I mean, I would consider it, but I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Slay E also has resub for six months. Thank you, Slay E, for a nice six month resub. I appreciate that. All right, let's take a look. Shit. So, hmm. I want to make everything look uniform. So, if I'm going to build, if I want to make a dock, I think I need to extend it a little bit further out here. Oh, shit, I don't have any left. Oh, shit. <laughs> of course I don't have any left. Oh, man. Oh! What the? Scared me. Like a spider out of nowhere. Where'd you come from? A swimming spider? Along came a spider. Come here, fucker. Now you're a dead spider. There we go. This is why I gotta build a fence. I gotta build a fence so these, these guys can't sneak up on my ass, right? Plus, here's the thing. Here's the cool thing. This will create become a dock where I can actually fish. Because it's been fishing or it's been raining a lot, and I haven't been able to fish. So I'll actually have a dock to fish. You know how much I like fishing in this game. I think fishing's one of the most rewarding and relaxing things to do in Minecraft. So to build this dock a little further out and then have uh, you know, an area to fish would be pretty cool. And also a dock with a boat. I can put my boat down. 
Okay. All right, so I actually need more... Um, I need more wood planks. I got to create more wood planks over at the bench. Let's see. Mr. Papa Vera Chase said, you have all the materials. Like, if you harvested a lot of oak trees and use shears to collect the leaf blocks, those would be the only two blocks you need. So in the practice with, you would need a lot of leaves and logs, though. Beer Jishin did a 100-bit chair. said, looking forward to the competition. Are taxes being taken into the count when, ta when calculating the top chair? I will tell you... Ladies and gentlemen, who the top contributor is? Tonight, it is still Yoshino... Oh, excuse me. It's not Yoshino over. It is Pard. So, if Pard ends up being the top contributor for the night with that $20 tip, they will actually get something named after them, and they'll be able to choose what they want named after them. Of course, the thing is, because they did it like that, I don't know who they actually are. So, actually, I don't know how I'm going to do that. I'm not thinking about it. I'm like, wait a minute. How am I going to do that? Because I actually don't know who that was. <laughs> oh, shit. All right? Yeah, that's true. Anyone know how to do this? Man, now I don't know how to do this. Because let's say, for a perfect example, this person, you know, tipped me, and they used that name. Someone else could tip and use that same name and say it's them and say, I want this named after me, and it's not really them. So how do we do this now? <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I know. I actually know. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I think I know how to do this. Yes. So here's how this works. When you tip me, I get to see your email address that you lo that you registered with as you tipped me, okay? So I can confirm this guy who he is via his email address. He can choose to either email me from that email address or he can leave, you know, another tip under that email address saying, "Okay, this is what I want named after me." Okay? That's the two ways that it can be done. For ch for cheering, it's way easier. Cheering is linked to the Twitch account, right? So, cheering, I know who you are because I know your name on Twitch. And then you can just say it right in the stream chat, okay? Fair enough. That's how we'll do it. That's the fair way to do it. Uh, incorrect. I never said I didn't see any of that info. I said the only thing I see is your email address that you registered on PayPal with to send me the tip. I've explained that many times in the past. You're talking out of your butt. Straight out of your butt. Um, I will need some of this dirt. I'm going to try to even out this path. Will grass just start to grow naturally on here? I hope so. I like this all to be nice and even. See? Like that. That's good. Okay. Is that good? I think that will that even out eventually, or is there a way to even it out? I don't know. Hopefully that evens out eventually. I don't know how this works. Oh, uh, let's see here. Dark Side Johnson did a 50 bit cheers. What do you think about the Firefly Funhouse on Raw? I feel like it's refreshing to finally see a wrestler have a bit of creative control over his direction in WWE again. Um, I like it at the same time. I don't want it to get played out, and now they've been doing it for two months. And the question is, when will it get played out? Because eventually it will be, in my opinion. And I think that he needs to debut and do something rather than just have this fun house. I'm just saying. Um, Realm of Chaos just here. He said, yeah, there are a ton of characters in the Crash universe. My favorite is the Yaya Panda from the Nash Nitro Kart games. Okay, never heard of that one. Cr N Nitro Kart. Well, I th that's what we're playing, right? Crash Team Racing Nitro Refueled. I don't know if it's the same one or not. I know they made a bunch of them. Okay. Um, all right, I need to go make... Some more uh, of the oak panels, and I need to make some fencing. How much fencing do I have? 19. Actually, that's actually a good amount. I might not need more, but we'll see. Let me find my, my crafting here. What's up, Chris B? How's it going? Good evening. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Nope, don't have any extras. I made all those stairs, and I'm never going to use them now. Okay, that should be enough. Alright, uh, Rumble Chaos shoot again. So there are a ton of characters in the Crash Universe. Oh, I already read that. Excuse me. 
Oh, okay. Tits for Bits says that Par said horse face wife in Dutch. Is that really what that meant? Can anyone actually 100% confirm that, that that's what it means? Because if he did say that, then I'm just going to fucking disqualify his ass. <laughs> yeah, I don't care. <laughs> it's my stream. It's my discretion. I can do whatever the fuck I want. I can disqualify his ass right now. That's actually what he said. Oh, shit. Hurry up with this. The translator... Why did the translator get banned? He shouldn't get banned. Guys, do not ban the translator if he's telling the truth. We don't know if that's true or not. It didn't come up. Yeah, let me see. Let me see something. What did you say? What, what language did you say it was? Because I'm looking it up. It's Dutch. Okay. Okay, hold on. Oh, uh, I mean, it might be. It doesn't look like that, though. Let's see. I'm sure these words mean. Why did it have to be a fucking... All right, I'm making a new rule. If I don't understand what the fuck your name is or what you're saying, you can't get any credit for it. All right? Get, wow, one of the words meant get sucked. <laughs> one of the words meant get sucked. What the fuck? All right, that's enough of that. All right, we're reverting back. <laughs> we're reverting back. What a name. What a, what an asshole. We're going to revert back. Who is? It was actually Tadpoles playing tennis before that person who was the top tipper. Okay. <laughs> oh shit! What the fuck? You co ah! No! What an ass! Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Jesus Christ, man! A fucking stupid ass fucking zombie came up on my ass and started attacking me. All right, I'm gonna take this asshole off the leaderboard. He doesn't even deserve to be up there. And we're going to go back to Tadpoles. What was it? Camp Dancing Tadpoles? What was his name? The Tadpoles that dance? His name was... Tadpoles playing tennis. Oh, had nothing to do with tap dancing at all. Okay, let's try this. Tadpoles playing tennis. And the top respectable tipper of the night. Which means you still get up there on the leaderboard as the top tipper. And that other guy can... can uh, can go suck horse cocks or whatever he was trying to tell me to do there with his uh with his tip there you go try english next time all right so now let's continue uh mr papa very he says looks good so far you can also use slabs oh i gotta sleep i got nothing done i got absolutely nothing done he says, looks good so far you can also use slabs or stairs in place or on top of solid blocks so you don't have to jump you can also do pier ties on the sides of the dock using logs that stack up from the bottom of the water over the surface, spacing them a few blocks apart. Okay. Ooh, excuse me. I think I, I like his suggestion. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use stairs. I want to see if I can make a stairwell here. 
So it's easy to walk up and down instead of having to jump. See? I want to make stairs you can just walk up. So I think I'm going to do that. So as I do that, shout out to Nihilus the Goldfish who did a, a 10,045 bit cheer. 10,045 bit cheer. Damn. And he says, let's spice things up a bit. Well, I'm pretty sure at this point, Nihilistic Goldfish is probably the top contributor of the night. I'm just going to go out on a limb and say that. <laughs> Indeed he is. So thank you, Nihilistic Goldfish. I appreciate that. And uh, will anyone in the next hour and a half actually top that? I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out, huh? But uh, I'm pretty, I'm, I would say you could probably feel pretty confident you're going to be the top contributor of the night. I'm just saying. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Cody Carl Schuster, why do people think they can get away with saying anything because they attach money behind it? Well, I don't, I don't necessarily think they can think that they can get away with it. Like, this guy tipped, and there's no way I can do anything about Tim tipping and insulting me in a tipper. You know what I mean? Um, but, oh, it's raining. Oh, shit, do I have... Do I have my fishing pole? I don't think I have it. I think I left it back at the house, which sucks. Let me see. Everyone's running around. Oh my god, I have it! Oh wow, this is cool. See, the dock's not done yet, which really stinks. It really stinks because, oh fuck. Just in case I need to use the bow and arrows. It means that I basically can't, uh, I'm not going to be defended. I could fish, but I'm not going to be defended as I fish here. I'm going to get attacked, so I'm going to have to switch over and attack people, too. We'll attack zombies and shit. My dock is not, all right, I'm still going to fish on my dock. I don't care. Here we go. Nice. Let's see what we get. All right, I haven't fished in a long time, right? I used to do this every, almost every session of Minecraft, and I haven't done it in a while now. Um, mostly because I've been working on, you know, this village stuff, so now I actually get to fish, which is really relaxing. I got an ID tag! Oh my god, I don't even have to, um, I don't even have to, uh, go back to my house to name something tonight. Yeah, I don't have to. I got an anonymous dollar tip saying part is just horse and Dutch. Maybe the person actually is Dutch and wanted to actually name a horse tonight if he was the top tipper. That's that is possible. But I'm just gonna say this, and this, I'm just gonna make this very clear up front. If you want want something like that, you gotta freaking be upright in English. I can't I can't be translating stuff on stream to figure out if you're trying to insult me and my wife and so I can't I can't do it. All right, I just can't. So apologies if this person was a legit tipper who was trying to be nice and just wanted me to name a horse something on the stream. But I need you to write it to tell me in English, so I'm not confused as hell what the hell's going on, okay? So I had to take that off the leaderboard because I didn't know what it meant. But, you know, if this guy comes back and says, no, I was, I, you know, I was actually being honest and I was being a nice guy. I was just trying to insult you, then maybe I'll get him back on the leaderboard there. Super Flash Cheers, and I'm here to chill with you. How have you been? I've been good. I've been good. Tonight, already 30 minutes in. It seems like I just started, but, uh, we got a lot going on. Yes, it did. Lieutenant C. Cortez apparently has said horse, and one of the other words meant sucking. So, it probably was a troll tip. I, I agree, Steve Cortez. Ah, Yoshino Lover says that he has put up his viewer's choice vote. He has voted for Assassin's Creed 1. That's actually a good one. I never played it for YouTube or Twitch. Um, I did play it during that year and a half when I was playing games offline before I started doing YouTube. And I actually really liked it. Although the game is a, a, a big grind, I think that'd be, it's fine. I could play it as a downtime thing. And while I'm grinding for eye collectibles and stuff, I could be, you know, interacting with viewers. So I think it would actually work as a good playthrough. I actually do. Okay. Wow, I finally get to freaking fish. First time in a million years. I already got an enchanted book. I already got an ID tag, so I'm getting good stuff. 
Mr. Bob Vera Cheer, he said, another idea about being exposed while fishing, if you make the log stack up higher over the dock, you can place fence blocks between the logs that would prevent mobs from getting to you, but you still might get shot at from one of the hills unless you build a rod over the dock. Fair enough. Actually, when at life, this this webcam is, is uh, a whopping 12K resolution. The only thing is that it's cr crunched so small you can't see the detail. Or I'll blame Twitch. Oh, it's uh, Twitch's bitrate. Lowers my 12K resolution down. It looks terrible. There you go. I'm going to go with that. Okay. Jesus, these, these fish are biting fast. I'm throwing it in. They're biting immediately. Chris B says, at some point, Assassin's Creed Rogue Remastered has to happen. It's, it's, a, it's a good game. Maybe. So right now, again, guys, I should remind you. I've got, by the way, Yoshi all over. Thank you for actually bringing that up. I actually forgot to mention it. The polling for the viewer's choice right now. Not the polling, excuse me. But the nominations for the viewer's choice event is open right now on the kingofhate.com forums. You have to go to the kingofhate.com, register for the forums, and you can post up the games you want to nominate to see me play as a summer playthrough right now. And all of you are eligible for the first time ever. It's 100% open to anyone to post up the games you want to see me play. So please do so. This is going to be open for a couple of weeks. And after a couple of weeks, I'm going to tally up the nominations and see what games were nominated the most. And those are going to go to a final poll that you will be voting on to determine what game will actually make it into a full playthrough. Well, Communist wants to know if this game has diamond chanclas. Uh, yes. They're the rarest item in the game. <laughs> Darkside Dolphin asks, will be playing online for Crash Team Racing or are you just doing the story? Both. I'm going to do, if it has a full story mode, I'll do it. And I want to play online, just like I do with Team Sonic Racing. I want to do both. Now, I'm hoping the game plays better than Team Sonic Racing. If you guys didn't see my session of Team Sonic Racing... It was hard to find matches, and the matches were dropping and having issues. So I hope that's not the case with Team Crash or Crash Team Racing. <clears throat> Hobo X, I indeed I do actually have a PS2. I still have a PlayStation 2, but I have no method to, to effectively capture from the PlayStation 2. I used to have a thing that would do it, and it broke. And it was, that was the HD PVR2, and since then I don't have any method. It's funny because my capture device right now, which is now at this point four and a half years old or four years old i've been using it constantly since 2015 it's supposed to be able to capture from like a com component and it doesn't i have the adapter and everything for it and when you do it it gets no signal it never works it only uses hdmi so i would not be able to capture from a ps2 <clears throat> what is up uh locust of the porg and redheaded punk how are you guys doing tonight <clears throat> i've been good redheaded punk thank you for asking Cody Carl said, I thought you also had a Rock Show Game Capture HD that can also capture PS2. Dude, that stopped working a long time ago. That stopped working before I even moved across the country. That thing died and just broke on me. So, I don't have that anymore either. I got rid of everything. All I have is this right here. The HDP... What's this called? I'm um, not HDP VR2. It's the, the Avermedia Extreme Cap something, something, something. That's all I have right now. If that dies, I have to go buy another capture device. I probably have to go like Best Buy and see what they got or Amazon and see what they got. But thank God it's still working. No, she don't love her. No worries. He says, I would love to have my, my name on a sign, but uh, it's not a big deal. Listen, uh, this is not the only time I'm going to be doing this. You guys know I usually play Minecraft about once a week. So, you know, since pe if some people like this, I would consider doing it again in the future. Okay. I got another ID tag. Two-in-one fishing session. Damn. Yes, I still have my 3DS right here. Look. Right here, Jack. Jack's part of his ass. Right here. Right next to me. I had actually cleaned it up and made it work. Because I was going to take it with me on my trip to Connecticut in April. And then last minute, I decided not to for whatever reason. So I made sure everything works with it. And it does. It's still, you know, fully usable. I don't know if the capture device still works, though. I haven't used the 3DS capture device in a million years. Uh. The hell's going on? There we go. Did that chicken just run into the to the river? 
It did. Stupid chicken. Cody Carlshire says, you didn't play Octopath Traveler because you were too busy beating Persona 5. Now you're doing Final Fantasy 9. Never consider playing Octopath when you're done. Uh, maybe eventually. Maybe eventually. I've never, I never said that I was against playing Octopath. Just it, it hasn't been in the cards yet. Is it the XL or the original? That is the XL. Because when they were selling uh, 3DS capture uh, devices online, they were only had the XL available. So that's what I got. I guess for whatever, for whatever reason, making an XL uh, device uh, capture compatible is easier than doing a regular 3DS. Maybe because I don't know the size of the hardware. I don't know. Bad Vice Podcast says, would I be able to nominate a Left 4 Dead co-op as a viewer's choice stream? Watching you watching you watch your playthrough a few weeks ago was fucking hilarious. The bottom line is, I don't think that would work. Reason being, you're nominating an incredibly old multiplayer game, and chances are I wouldn't be able to find matches enough consistently. And plus, that's really not a game you can do a playthrough of, when you really think about it. Like, is it a game that I could play? Yes. Is it a game I could do, like, a full playthrough of? No, unless you want to see me do the whole story again. But as for multiplayer, like, what, what exactly would I do... You know what I mean? This is the wrong bow. I grabbed the wrong bow. Oh, no. Here's the correct bow. I was like, wait a minute. There it is. Because I saw a skeleton up there. I want to be ready at the ready. The skeleton comes down here. Super Flash here and it says, if you were a video game, would you be an alpha or a beta? Wow. I would be a closed demo. How about that? Exclusive elitist closed demo only for influencers. Only influencers would get to play me. Because I only want influencers to touch me. That's it. No one else is allowed to touch me unless they have influence. There you go. Haha. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Very good shit, brother. Ah. Oh, I do have a trident. Locust of the poor. I have like a hundred tridents back at my house. This is my house. This is a village that I'm at currently. At my house, I got a ridiculous amount of tridents. Yoshida Lover says, be playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Oh, I've been playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey and nothing can be, nothing can beat me as of yet because I have great gear. I found I found the, the bow and arrow was incredibly overpowered. Even though later on I got better melee capabilities that also made me crazy good. The bow and arrow was like crazy good if you focused on it. Insane headshot damage in that game. Dark Side Dolphin Shooter said, Do you think you'd be more likely to get the PS5? Since most of your game library is already on PlayStation, that's why I may get PS5, even the next Xbox is way better. I have no idea. That's a great question, and I, I don't know how to answer it yet. I would not have an answer until we get more information about these consoles, so. Yeah, I play or bring my Switch to Connecticut with Cat. Actually, good RPG. We were thinking about that. Cat thought she might get Breath of the Wild for it and play it on the plane because we had such a long flight. But for whatever reason, last minute, we just decided against it. We did. I don't know. We just didn't feel like doing it. We ended up just watching, like, like TV and movies on the plane on the televisions that were in there, pretty much. Or, or napping when we could. Is there a reason I use PC streaming instead of built-in PS4 Twitch? Yes. Many reasons. Number one. Complete control of the quality. I can completely control the broadcast settings, tweaking them for different resolutions, tweaking them for, for the bit rate that I stream at, an incredibly easy rate using OBS. Number two, as you can see with OBS, I got complete customization with the webcam, with overlays. I can change this up here, the leaderboard. Oh, it's all on the fly. On PS4... There are ways you could do stuff like that, but it's way harder to do. It's not easy and integrated as easily as this is here. Um, and also, it's easy to capture, because here's the other thing. When I record, and sh when I stream, I also record. And when I record, I'm recording for YouTube. By doing this, everything's already on the PC. Can you imagine if I was streaming from the PS4, but then I had to capture separately, or I was capturing on PS4 and I had to transfer? It would be a nightmare. It would be like a pain in the butt. If I didn't have this set up previously, before PS4 existed... Yeah, PS4 is an easy way to jump into the streaming scene. But for me, I already had all this stuff anyway, so it made sense to understand, oh, I know how to capture, I know how to do this. So that's why I do it this way. It just makes more sense.
What? Za69 says, could you please do a DSP tricep for Chick-fil-A? I donated over $100 before asking for it. Huh? No one ever donated $100 asking for Chick-fil-A, dude. I hate to tell you. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> that never happened. Spawn Killer took me $2. Says, do you like Alpha Omega Sin? You, why didn't you do chill streams in the past? Uh, I don't I don't watch Alpha Omega Sin. I know nothing about the guy besides the fact that he personally insulted me years ago. Saying that apparently I'm, I'm a horrible fighting game player who just whines and complains. And basically I'm no good at the, any game. Even though I am very good at many different fighting games. The guy was basically just talking out of his ass and piling on to negative memes about me. So I called him out about it and he decided instead of actually addressing it in a mature manner to challenge me to a, a real life fight. Which I declined and said, I'm not five years old. I'm not going to fight you, you fucking idiot. And that was the end of the interaction we ever had. So apparently the guy's a moron who doesn't like me and just insults me for clout. Like most content creators who ever mentioned me. And that's all I know about the guy. So it's sad because he could have had a positive interaction or whatever. But instead the guy chose to be a dick. So he's a fucking dickhead. That's all I know. Why, don't I, why didn't I do chill streams in the past? Very simple because I used to do videos just for a YouTube audience. It wasn't about the interactions like we're doing right now. It wasn't about that. It was about me creating videos for an offline audience who don't really care about the interactions. They just wanted to see, mostly, the, the genuine quality of the gameplay of, like, new releases and stuff. They didn't care about, oh, Phil interacting with people and answering questions and stuff like that. It wasn't an organic relationship. It was more like, I am isolated and I play a game and I, I'm doing this for review purposes. You know what I mean? Like, it was a more more heavy professional thing and now when i do these chill streams look how i don't care i'm just fishing you know i can just fish and answer your questions and have fun and this is fun to me i don't know about you guys i like doing this i really do i enjoy doing this stuff so for me this is a totally different kind of content creation that i didn't used to do because i'm on stream and interacting you know what i mean now that basically I don't really care anymore about the YouTube scene. I don't care about having my channel be big on YouTube. I barely make any money on YouTube because the, the ad revenue bottom fell out two years ago. I don't care about focusing in and making that kind of content anymore. I just don't. Now, I'm not saying... I'm definitely not saying that... Um, hold on a second. I'm definitely not saying that... Um, I don't still do video game playthroughs for the sake of doing a serious playthrough. If there's a new release or a hot new game and I'm interested in doing a serious coverage of it, I will do that, okay? Um, but the bottom line is that, in general, when I do a chill stream like this, it's completely different content creation. It feels so different than what I used to do. But I love it. I actually really enjoy it. Vote Communist did 100-bit cheer. It said, another scammer gifter like Tim Schafer and Hideo Kojima. I don't know what you're talking about. I wasn't aware of Tim Schafer or Hideo Kojima scamming me. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I never heard of that. Tim Schaefer is basically a, a, a con artist, saying that he was going to make a game and he just basically didn't finish it, and he kept, you know, basically squandered all the money for Kickstarter. That definitely happened. Hideo Kojima didn't ever do that. I don't know what you're talking about. Permanent Picasso said, "Is it eight-hour plane flight from Washington to Connecticut?" Um, one way I want to say it was between five to six hours. The other way it was between six and a half to seven and a half hours because of the rotation of the Earth. It makes the flight longer. So, there you go. Ah, oh, fudge. Well, that ended prematurely. I expected that to go a lot longer. All right, if it's still nighttime, I can go to sleep. Oh, shit. I gotta go get my bed back quickly, very quickly, before the sun comes up. Come on, hurry up. Go, 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 go. go. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Where's my bed? Where's my bed? Give me two minutes. Quickly, 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 quickly. Ah, uh, ah. Oh. Oh, yeah, I made it. I made it. Damn, that was close. The sun was coming up, too. That shit was close. All right, good stuff. Let's see what I got. I got two name tags. I got Projectile Protection 4. That's probably really good for armor, I would guess. Agua Affinity 1. Ah, that's shitty. I also got a few rods. Unbreaking 2. Look at this. Uh, Unbreaking 3. Look at the C2. Lure 1. I had, Look at the C3. Lure 3. Mending 1. So, honestly, that's better because it's 3 3 and mending when it heals itself. Look at the C3. Eh, okay. Nothing too amazing. What about these bows? Infinity 1. Mending 1, power 3, punch 1. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. Put all these away. I guess I could technically cook a ton of fish. I have a furnace, right? 
I could cook a ton of fish to make more food so I don't have to leave right away. Because that's where, one of the reasons I was going to leave, but maybe I don't have to. Put my fishing rod away now. Put all this shit away. What's the best? Uh, this is just water, right? A water bottle. Um, I got those ID tags. Yeah, I'm going to cook some fish. Some cod. I need coal. I only have one coal. Maybe I got some coal in there already. Let me look. Ah, oh, fuck. I ran out of coal. I forgot how to do this. How do you make coal? I completely forgot how to make coal. Anyone remember? Do you just put wood in here? Maybe you just put wood in? Maybe. Mr. Papa Vera cheered. It's a protection for us. The best protection enchant and mending is really good. You want that on your gear. I'm glad I found him. We can smelt logs. So I gotta put whole logs in there, huh? How do you smelt a log? I don't remember. Snooty Roo says, Why do people keep asking for DSP tries it and cooking with the king? It's very simple. People can't let go of the past, all right? It's just like when I first moved here, people kept asking me to do co op with John Rambo constantly. Now, I moved here in 20, the summer of 2014. It took until the fall of 2015 for John to finally fess up and just admit he didn't want to do anything with me anymore. Um, but people harassed the shit out of me about it all the fucking time, constantly. And I was like, guys, I moved across the country. It's not easy to do. When, if John wants to do it, I'm sure he'll contact me. They just harass you know, That's what I mean. People do not like change. There's people who have been around watching me for a very long time, and they liked the old stuff. And they're sad it's not around anymore. And I understand that. But at the same time, I do think that people have to get used to change at some point. Um, and a lot of people just don't. Just being honest. Alright, how do I make this... Uh, how do I make this coal? Do you use wood to, do you use wood to burn wood? I guess not. How do you use... How do you... Oh. You just put it right in there, huh? You just toss it in there by itself. It cooks itself. Yeah, it cooks itself. I don't think I need too much coal. Maybe a couple pieces. Oh, what happened? Wait. You do use one piece of wood to burn the other wood. Uh... All right. What I want to do is get two or three pieces of coal and cook all this fish so I have fish to eat. What happened? I don't want to do that. Oh, my God. I don't know what's going on anymore. Place one. There. So let's do this. What the fuck happened? Where did they go? That's what I wanted to do, separate it. Okay, let's do that. While that's going, right, let me grab my fence pieces. Where are my fence pieces? What the hell? I have gates. What happened? I oh, here they are. Let me see what I can do around the dock. Well, that's going. Darkside Johnson Chudy says, Would you complete at WrestleMania in a 2v1 match versus Brock Lesnar and Paul Heyman where the winner takes home $1 million with the losers to join the Vince McMahon Kiss My Ass Club? No, I would not. Absolutely not. Okay. Yeah, all right. It did grow, regrow. No, I just need to, to fix that path part, but I need my shovel to do that. All right, let's see here. Wait, what? Oh, okay, so where's the fence? Doesn't. Oh shit. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. Stop that. Oh fuck. God damn it. 
Beer Jishin Shitty says, long time listener, first time caller. Do you think Jason Giambi should be a good coach for the New York Knicks? I have no idea what you're even talking about. Who the fuck's Jason Giambi? I don't know who that is. I don't I don't watch sports. What is going on? No, I didn't want that. I guess it's actually alright. Who the fuck is Jason Giambi? <laughs> I only have four fence pieces left. Oh, God damn it, man. Uh, I gotta get way more wood. I'm gonna leave the dock end open so I can fish and also dock my boat there. This looks messy, but I probably want to put a few more pieces there. I need more freaking fencing now. I'm never gonna finish this town. I'm serious. There's always something else I want to do. And then it takes forever to do. And the next thing I know, I, I always get sidetracked doing something else. I'm glad I got the name tags, though, so I can name something after the top contributor. So right now... Nihilistic Goldfish, definitely the top contributor right now with that ginormous cheer. Thank you for that Nihilistic Goldfish. You're definitely in the lead right now. I believe we're about to hit an hour streaming. So I'm probably going to split the part. Um, ooh. Okay, here we go. Exactly what I wanted. So now I can do this. No, not that. This. There. Cook those fish for me. Alright, so I need to make... What the fuck? What is that? I need to make... I need to make... How do you make the freaking... Uh, I want to make fencing. There you go. Okay, 27 pieces, that should be enough. <laughs> Super Flash says, have I seen Rambo First Blood? Yeah, I've seen all the Rambo movies. I've seen every one of the Rambo movies. Wet Crab Shooty said, do you think a baseball team would ever have a perfect season? I'll hang up and listen. Uh, I have no idea. How do you have a perfect season but you never lose a game? Is that even possible? Has a baseball team ever never lost a game? With the insane amount of games that are in a football season, or a baseball season, excuse me, how on earth could you not lose a game? Like, that would have to be, like, insanely small odds, right? That you would not lose a game. I would think, anyway. Shit. I need a piece of dirt to put there so I can finish the fence. Nihilistic Goldfish says, if I win, I want the dock named after me. A, put a sign. A sign that says Nihilistic Goldfish Docks. Or how about Nihilistic Goldfish Pier? How does that sound? Okay, um. I need a p dirt. I was grabbing dirt. There you go. And also, let me grab the, uh, the shovel. Nihilistic Goldfish Pier. Oh, <laughs> he likes that. Okay. There we go. Nice. Nice. Okay, it's exactly what I wanted. Boldy says maybe eventually I could do a supporter wall where I list top contributors. I could do that. I could make a supporter wall. Well, I could. You're absolutely right. I'm not going to do that now, but maybe eventually. It's an interesting idea. I guess I'm aware I'm going to have to make this taller. I'm going to run out again. Oh, no. you got to be kidding me. I am. I'm going to run out. I think an enemy might be able to walk over the edge here. I could be wrong. But I think they, they would be able to walk and jump over. I think what I'm going to have to do is destroy these blocks. So nothing can walk and jump over the edge of this dirt, right? Yeah. It's getting nighttime again, by the way.
destroy these procs. Now they have to do like a running jump, right? They have to do like a crazy running jump to get over here. Okay. Yeah, see? They can do it from here. I knew it. So what I'm going to have to do is move the torch. I'm going to make this like an unreachable ledge. Oh my god, it's rock? It's rock under there. There we go. I put the torch right there. I gotta go to sleep. Okay, holy goodness. Oh my goodness. Uh, Beardrician Chitty said, do you think the, the New York Giants and San Francisco Giants ever hang out or have dinner? <laughs> yes, of course. They are ind indeed cousins, so of course they have dinner all the time. What crap trees is it true you have a Seattle sports podcast you record in your off time? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> sports side fills a bullpen of of madness. Of course. There you go. Of course I do. All right, let's end, let's, uh, end this part here. <laughs>